Hey guys and gals, my name is Carl here at Repairs Universe doing the walkthrough for your Nexus 5 Take Apart Guide. If you have any problems, please follow us on Twitter and Facebook. Let's get you started. You're going to need three tools with us today. It's going to be a small metal pry tool, small flathead screwdriver, and a small screwdriver Phillips. Please join us at RepairsUniverse.com for all your parts and necessities of all your phone needs. We also do tablets and MacBooks. Once you have the tablet in your hand, please take a look at the back. The back is actually a clip-on back and it's not very accessible to slide to unlock it. You can try from the bottom, there's more adhesive, but try from the top right where the audio jack connection, audio port, coax cable connection is. Use a pry tool. Once you have it open, you can basically start to wiggle your way in and start uh, using the clips from right to left. Um, do not break or pull because the back is plastic and it will rip and crack. Take your time with this and just go with ease. Once you have the back off, do not worry about any antennas or anything like that. You're going to see 10 screws. They're going to be Phillips, and that's what all you're going to be using highlighted as you see now. Once you have all 10 screws out, place those to the side and keep a hold of them in a great area. Do not lose those. Let's go ahead and get started at the top clip-on. Pop that guy right off, and there is a bottom clip-on too. This is protection of the flex cables that keeps everything pushed down towards the phone so nothing's hanging out. Now once you have all your clips removed, you're going to see your flex cables. Please remove those bit by bit, slowly by slowly. Do not force the flexes to remove themselves. If you do, you're going to hurt yourself. Once you get them started, just slowly work your finger in and slowly pop off the connection flex. The one you see here is actually for the charging port and the mic. Uh, the next one you're going to be seeing is the battery connection. Please take your time. Again, do not rush yourself. Do not break the flex connections. You do not need to solder today. The next one is below is the LCD connection, and you have the camera, back-facing camera, and then the front-facing camera. Once you have the flex cables removed. Uh, go ahead and take the metal pry tool and slide it at the bottom right of the battery and wiggle up to break the connection piece of the of adhesive and now the battery is removed. Go ahead and remove the antenna connections. Take your time on this. Do not rip or break or cut these cables. Once you have the antennas removed that you would like, now it's time to work on the top motherboard. Now the top motherboard is kind of tricky. There is adhesive keeping it connection. What we're going to do is just take the metal pry tool and slide it into the far right side of your looking and cut a corner it, knock it back and forth and you slowly pull the motherboard away from the back of the phone and it will start to break the adhesive that is sticking it together. Once you have that replieved, now you have everything taken. Uh, go ahead and remove the antennas that is bothering it and now your top camera that's back front facing camera that is replaced. Go ahead and remove the other antenna on the left side and the other antenna on the right hand side. Once you have these removed it's easier to move around and you're not prone to break or snap those connection cables. Once you have the antenna that's removed out of the way, you're going to be working on the low flex connected to the phone so you can actually remove it to get to the LCD connections. Once you remove the bottom one, go slow on this guy and work your way around because if you go too fast, you're going to rip the LCD and I can't trust that enough guys. Take your time here. 
once you have it slowly come up, remember, go slow, and you're done. Congratulations, uh, you basically repaired the Nexus 5, and it's it seems easy, it seems hard, it just take your time and you can very do it. There's a couple more left over, it's basically the bottom flex of the LCD and the top, the back facing camera. Once you have those removed, you basically have done the phone. Congratulations guys. Uh, be sure to subscribe to our on YouTube channel and check our website for more repairs and updates at repairsuniverse.com. Have a great day guys, my name is Carl.